ISI project was based on the idea of Think Before You Splash. We, last summer, lots of people drowned in our local area and it really like affected our, all the people in our area. We found out that there's, in our local area, there's a weir and there's no life boys right beside where people would be swimming and that the only, the closest water boy was up on the bridge, which you had to like run and get if someone was drowning. So we decided to do our YSI project based on drownings. And it was raising awareness for water safety, trying to get people to like learn more about their like local rivers and stuff. So we created a water safety booklet and we handed it out just to like show what to do when when, when like drowning drownings happen. And we wanted to show that it is fun to be out on the water. So we brought loads of skills rafting down the River Liffey just to raise awareness about water safety. We did a survey before the other skills went rafting to see how much they knew about water safety and the ecology and like they really knew nothing about it at all. So after they had the rafting trip and after they got their lesson plan, we did another survey and they could answer everything. Like So we know that like it did actually make a difference what we did. It felt really good for us making a po positive change because um, we were all so badly affected by what happened last year. So we really felt that like it, it was our turn to make the difference and change what happened last year. So it felt good to know that we were making a difference with all the families and they know now that like we are all safe now down at the weir this summer. I think that being dedicated to your project and having a passion for your project is what makes a good social innovator. Like if we weren't passionate for what we did, we wouldn't have stayed back after school, put in as much effort and all, and it took a lot of time and hard work, but like in the end, we got a really good result out of it. It feels really good making a difference with people because it's like all the work that we put into and it like our project is actually making a difference and it's actually like, it set out what we wanted to do. I think the secret of being a brilliant young social innovator is working together as a group, like putting up, putting in lots of hard work to raise awareness about the, our project. YSI helped me change the way I think about the world because it made me realise that there's a lot of problems and that YSI can actually make a difference. The Speak Out is where everyone gets a two minute chance to show off their project and show the difference they made and what they've done. And it was a really fun day, like it was so good to see all the other projects and see like what we were up against and like everyone, everyone's project was so good. That standard was like so high. I was so nervous before we went on because like we put so much work into it and that, like it, it was like finally ready and we were like oh like I hope we don't like mess up but it was really good. I'd really recommend YSI. It was like everyone in our group has said it has been their favourite part of Transition Year. It was a project that we picked ourselves. We weren't told you have to do this, you have to do that and we could have our own ideas. It wasn't someone telling us what to do, like we could do whatever we wanted. Like you get to like know your teachers on like a personal level and get closer with your friends and like like work on social issues or whatever. I just say like like pick a project that you're really passionate about and that you will put the work into and make the effort to like be really good because like the work does pay off and like all the groups here have shown that the work does pay off and you can make a difference.